Hey guys, it's Samira and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be unboxing the white iPhone 13 mini. Here it is in all its glory. I am so excited for this phone because I haven't had a new phone since 2019. That was when I was in sixth grade and I got my first phone, the iPhone 8. And at the time, this was actually an old phone then, so you can imagine how ancient it seems now. I think the newest phone back then was the iPhone 11. So a lot of my, a lot of people in my grade literally had 11s and I was like, mm, no thank you. Um, but this phone is actually not bad not to dog on my a it's brought me through some good times and some bad times But the storage is really really low I think it's 64 gigabytes and I'm like at 63 and also the camera quality is just a no for me I'm so excited to have this because I can even like film like good quality videos on it and get some good pictures on it, too So yeah, let's just go on with the box. Let's just get on with the unboxing All right Let's start. So I went to the AT&T store and picked up this cute little iPhone 13 mini in the white Man, unboxing iPhones are so just honestly satisfying. Here it is. Bro, the camera is so pretty. Okay, I changed the angle around just a bit so you guys can see me and the phone at the same time. But here, so here's the box. Here's the actual phone. So we're gonna take it out. Here is the white Apple iPhone 13 mini. It is so pretty. Wow, look at that. Look at the light on it. I'm gonna take off this little piece of paper. I really need to get a screen protector and a case for this, but here it is, the iPhone 13 mini. And then I'm gonna take out the charging cable. It's a different charging cable. Yep, this is a new one. I don't understand why Apple does. I think the reason Apple makes like these new cords is so they can make more money because people need to buy them now. This is the same cord I use for my MacBook, so that is actually convenient. And then the designed by Apple in California. Wait, what is this? I forget what this little key thing is. Oh, I think it's for the SIM card, yeah. Change the SIM card and then we have our Apple sticker. So I need to pop this in so we can get this charged and set it up. <laughs> I kind of wanted to get the pink, but I didn't think I would like it very much. I just wanted to get pink because it was like a different and new color. Wait, this is so cool. So let's swipe up and we're going to... Oh, I can bring my iPhone near it to set it up. I remember doing this for the MacBook. That's pretty cool. Oh, bro, this is so cool. Wait a second. That's actually really cool. Hold your new iPhone up to the camera. That's pretty cool. That's actually pretty neat. I forgot, yeah, I do remember doing this with the MacBook. Or no, with my iPad. That's what it was. Enter passcode. So it had like a little like static -y thingy almost that I scanned with my old phone. Oh wait, yeah, my old phone. I did actually remember to back up my phone this time, so I'm probably gonna transfer everything. In this one, this phone has, I think, 128 gigabytes. I think that might be right, which is gonna be amazing. I'm so excited to have more um, data, or not data, but it's called storage. <laughs> I also want to do like a what's on my iPhone soon, so stay tuned for that. Face ID. Oh yeah, now I have face ID. Honestly though, like with masks, having touch ID is more helpful. Ew, I look crusty today. Move iPhone a little lower. Okay, we're gonna transfer all of my data, or data, however you wanna say it. Setting up my Apple ID. I love setting up new phones, it's so much fun. All right, we're gonna set up Siri. Press and hold the, okay, I just turned off the phone. Oh, here it says hello again, <laughs> in English this time. <laughs> anyway, oh, wait. Why did it tell me to set up Siri and then didn't let me set it up? Anyway, we're almost done transferring the data. Also, I named my phone Karen's iPhone. So, mostly so like when, I, when I'm on the bus or like people are at school or like I'm in an airport or something and I want to like airdrop stuff to random people, they don't know it's my phone. Pretty smart, but it says to myself, but it has confused my parents dozens of times. I forgot they tell you like you're supposed to charge your new devices right when you get them so then they have a good battery life i always forget that all right so my new phone is pretty much all set up um well not really there's still 23 minutes remaining until the data is complete i am so excited to use this phone i hope you guys enjoyed this little unboxing of the iphone 13 mini white i cannot wait to use it and i still need to buy like a case and a screen protector but i will be taking this phone to india so i'm excited that i can maybe like vlog with it a little bit versus you know bringing around the camera all the time this is definitely great for 
for like school vlogs if I can do that this year at all if I'm able to do that <laughs> definitely good for that because it's a perfect quality yet I don't need to bring my camera along so it's been about a week since I've had this phone I'm recording this little portion on it right now and I really really like it I will say if you have like an 11 or 12 probably not worth it for you to upgrade to the 13 um, I think a lot of people know that you know it's like a similar screen similar uh, features except for the cinematic like video that would be if you're into like videography or whatever and you want good quality videos that would be a reason to upgrade uh, I love the mini so like the 12 mini 13 mini it's just better I feel like more convenient slip it in your pocket and I don't really care about having a big screen but it really is up to preference but I do love this phone and I'm, I just love having all that storage like I don't need to worry about like deleting photos when I'm in the middle of recording something anyways I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in my next one bye